All right. I think it's, yes, now it's on. Perfect. All right. So, good afternoon. Good afternoon. How was your day? Great. Just good? How about amazing? Okay. So, students, I hope you met some really interesting judges that ask you good questions and that you had a good time talking with them and you met lots of students around you to talk with. They're doing research as well. And I hope it's been a wonderful day for you. So I want to make sure that we also include that we have people that are joining us in streaming uh, because we also had virtual judging on Wednesday for the people who couldn't come here in person. So I want to also welcome all of our virtual students that are joining us with streaming or maybe watching the award ceremony later if they couldn't connect in right away. And um, we will be posting a recording on our YouTube channel for uh, this event so you can watch for that in case you want to watch it again. So, and we are able to do that because of a very special person, Jeff Hatley, who has assisted us now for two years in doing the videotaping and recording and who has uploaded it to the YouTube channel. So all of our students and parents and family members and friends and teachers and anybody else you want to invite can see the awards ceremonies. Now we did discover that they changed the link on us this morning for the opening ceremony. So in case you had people that were trying to connect in for the opening ceremony, that link will be up later. So watch for that if you would like to watch that again. Um, so Jeff Hatley is with the North Carolina School of Science and Mathematics. And again, we would like to thank him. So. Okay. So share with other people. So students, I want to congratulate you again on being a regional award winner and coming to the State Fair. You are one of a very few across the entire state of North Carolina that made it to this level of competition. And so for the elementary students, we are the pinnacle for your competition and you are to be congratulated. This was a awesome task. You have done amazing research and we are so excited to have you here today and we hope you are as well. So we're thankful to be back again this year at our host site at North Carolina State University. And um, to be able to have the competition um, and the award ceremony and the welcoming. And right now, it's my pleasure to welcome Dr. Gary Kelly, who's our chairman of our North Carolina Science Fair Foundation Board so, of Directors, to bring us a few remarks. Gary? Thank you. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Judy. Good afternoon. <laughs> Outstanding, outstanding. I'm very honored to be the chair, chairman of the uh, board here um, as the nonprofit sp sponsor of the North Carolina Science and Engineering Fair. We are so very proud to be the state affiliate to both the Regeneron International Science and Engineering Fair for our senior division grand winners. For the second year, the Thermo Fisher Scientific Junior Innovators Challenge Award for our Junior Grand Award and the Dewey and Susan Rouse Memorial Award for our elementary division. On behalf of the board, the Science and Engineering Fair Planning Committee, our many judges and volunteers, and our devoted regional directors, we want to congratulate each and every one of you for being a regional winner and a state finalist, and for your initiative in engaging in science and or engineering research. Well done. <laughs> we also want to applaud the amazing efforts of our one, over 170 judges and over 125 volunteers who were so instrumental in making today happen. And I'm gonna do some here. Students, all of y'all who did your projects, y'all look like a fun group. Are y'all a fun group? Okay, here's what I would like for y'all to do. Really quickly, I would like for y'all to stand This is everyone applauding you for your efforts. 
No, keep standing, because I want you all to do something really quick for me, because you all are my fun group. I want you all to remember, you've had teachers, you've had your parents, you've had your family who have brought you here and have helped support you. And I want you all to turn around and give them a great round of applause. <laughs> Excellent, excellent. You may be seated. Before we recognize our award recipients, I'd like to recognize our wonderful sponsors. Our platinum sponsors, the Burroughs Welcome Fund, the Good Night Educational Foundation, and the SMT Center, the North Carolina Center for uh, North Carolina Science, Mathematics, and Technology Education Center, RTI International, DLH, Pfizer, uh, Broadcom Foundation, North Carolina Central College of Health and Sciences, the Triangle University's Nuclear Laboratory, our civil sponsors, the Strategic Educational Alliances, our bronze sponsors, Roe, Red Hat, Smith & Sinette Architecture, Crea Therapeutics, and Bolton and & Mink, and our NCSEF partners, North Carolina State University, Meredith College, Strawberry Studios, and STEM Wizard. Again, please enjoy, join me in expressing our uh, great gratitude to all of our sponsors. It is now my pleasure to introduce our MC for the awards division, Dr. Frida Sanders of Cryotherapeutics and a very active mentor, member of our Foundation of Board of Directors. Good, let's see, what time is it? Afternoon, everyone. It is my pleasure to be here. I would like to welcome all that are attending, both virtually and in person. And a sincere thanks to all the parents, all the teachers, uh, for all your support that's gone into supporting our elementary school students. On behalf of the North Carolina Science Fair Foundation, we would like to express special appreciation to Judy Day, our long-serving volunteer director of the North Carolina Science and Engineering Fair, for her leadership, and to all of the regional directors and the hundreds of judges and volunteers who worked throughout the year to make this happen. So thank you, Judy, for your 22 years of service. And also for those that were at the opening program today, uh, she, re she received a well-deserved recognition. The Judy Benton Day Award for Outstanding Service will keep her legacy of service vibrant for years to come. So let me also, yes, we can clap on that. Let me also thank Dr. Tom Williams behind me. Tom has served with Judy this year as our co-director, and he's agreed to serve as the volunteer director effective July 1st. Tom has been active with the North Carolina Science and Engineering Fair for the past 16 years. Thank you so much, Tom. So lots of clapping, hope your hands are ready. All right, so also please join me in recognizing North Carolina State University for serving as this host site for the past four years. And I just want to say that while certain projects will be recognized today, everyone here, uh, you are winners in the truest sense of the word for um, advancing to the State Fair this year. So we want to just applaud you for making it past the local and the regional level to get to the state level. And please connect with us on our social media channels. Um, you can also encourage uh, your students with any shout outs there as well. All right, so the moment we've all been waiting for, um, let's see, let me move this closer to me. We are going to start with our special awards. Okay. 
So I'm going to announce the special awards. Uh, we have a first, second, and third place this way. winner. And you can come up to my left, um, so your right, and you're going to exit the stage here. And they're go the photographs will be taken there. Oh, and you're going to have photographs taken. They're going to be go right into the photograph room with Dr. Bailey. You see Dr. Bailey waving his hands. He's a really fun and person. The photographs will be posted on our website for the parents. Okay, if you didn't hear that, the photographs that you take directly after receiving your award and exiting the stage, they will be emailed, you said? They'll be posted on the posted website. Posted on the website. All right. I would ask you to uh, just hold your applause until after we get through the first, second, and third place winners, and then we can clap for the entire category of winners. All right. <laughs> for NC Water, we have third place Tucker Harris. Second place, Hanaya Hussein. And first place, we have Ashriti Karthik Kamu. Congratulations to all of our NC One Water winners. Now for our SMT Promising Young Researcher Award. We have Jace Gibbs, Bryson Kennedy, and Chigochim in Ipa. Congratulations, you gotta have a picture taken. Congratulations to all of our SMT award winners. Now for our RTI Turning Knowledge into Practice Award. This one goes to Savannah Spruill. Congratulations, Savannah. Now for our Association of Women in Science North Carolina Chapter Award. This one goes to Bailey Cummings. Congratulations to our AWIS winner. Now for our Girl Scouts Creating a Better World, Girl Scouts of North Carolina Coastal Pines winner. This one goes to Abigail Ross.
congratulations. Now we're getting into our honorable mentions for elementary categories. So we have Lincoln Chambers. We didn't have a slide. Okay. Congratulations, Lincoln. We're gonna just jump back. We have um, one winner that we didn't get, and that is for North Carolina uh, Center for After School Programs. And this one goes to Ashrithi Karthik Kamu. Congratulations to our NCCAP winner. All right, so back to honorable mentions. We have Sloka Gautam, Beckett Willis, Charlie Saunders, Kimley Bar Barnett, Araya Sang, Anika, Prajapati, Henry Markwith, Cedra Baylock, Gunnar Martin, Trinity Dalton, Charlie Garland, Aiden Driscoll, Victor Mehta, Luke Johnson, and Boone Fasnat. Is this boom? He's exemplary. Yes. So, all right, and we've got these. We've got these three that weren't on the list. Okay. Okay. Oh yes, I called their names. So, Luke Johnson. Mm -hmm. And Luke Johnson and Victor Mehta and Anika Prajapati. Okay, they're not. They're not here. They may be virtual. That's right. Congratulations to all of our honorable mention winners. Now we're moving to exemplary awards. Boone Fasnacht, Presley Fisher, Maya Narsali, Lyndon Williams. Adarahi Naranjan Kumar. Eloise Jennings, Ro Ronan McLarney, Amina Abdullavia, Talia Sorensen, Oops, Lauren Satterfield, Brayden Lambert, Gage Williams. Lena Kimes, Lily Long, Riley Horn, Sawyer Sineski. Congratulations to all of our exemplary project winners.
Now we're going to call on Ms. Judy Day uh, to do the um, Scott Riles and Dewey Awards. Okay. We, we didn't give out the letters, but we gave out the certificates. Yeah. Okay. So that's our. Mm -hmm. we and we didn't. Okay. And we didn't yeah. give out the plaques either. That's what I said. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. You have the. Um, you want to move on with the uh, special awards? There are four of us standing here, and we didn't do it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so, so I think what we should do is they're getting their photographs made. We're just going to ask the honorable mention students. We'll call them up after the program mm -hmm. and do that. And but do the grand awards now. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So I don't know you want me to do that. So you, you advance. Okay. Okay, so we were so excited to be running on time today. You don't realize this is a record for us to be on time that we completely forgot to give out the medals for the honorable mention and the plaques for the exemplary projects. There are, you know, how many of us standing on stage? And none of, I mean, they're sitting right here and we forgot to give them. So after we call out these five top awards, we will be calling out the um, other projects that need to come and get their, their medals and their plaques, okay? You do have something more than a certificate coming to you, just not just then, but in the future. All right, do we want to do the drawing to make sure everybody's back? or Everybody back. Okay, yeah. so we'll do the drawing before yeah. we have them come up and get their medals yes. and plaques. Yeah. All right, so we will be doing a drawing of the people who completed the passport. And you've got the, you've got the it's right over there. Okay, we have the envelopes for those. They're ready to go. And there are gift cards in there, so good stuff. All right, so these five awards are for students that were looked at as the top five projects in the elementary division. And I would like to call up Scott Riles. Scott has been a judge with us for many, many years. He was the lead judge for a, quite a number of years. And um, his family, in honor of his mother and father, are, have donated this memorial award now for several years. And so um, it is a very nice award that is now worth the exemplary projects were $75. This is for $150. So we need to thank Scott and his family for these awards. Okay, so as I read the names, this time we will make sure that we do not forget to give you the plaques, okay? All right, do not let children, do not walk off the stage without a plaque in your hand, all right? So, let me see. The first award is Elementary Chemistry 004, Haley Yi. Okay, he's got them. Okay. The second Riles Award is Awetha Niven. And Elementary Earth and Environmental 0110. Remember, these also include the uh, virtual projects being judged, too. The third Riles Award is for Madeline Branch Elementary Biosciences 005. The fourth Riles Award is for Isabella Gorbachashi for the uh, Elementary Environmental Technology 002.
And the last Riles Award is for Elementary Bioscience, Biological Sciences 002, Cora Kite. Okay. All right, girls. If you'll go down and get your phone, Judy. Yes. What, what, what Frida's going to do is she's going to ask the, we're going to do the passport, and then we're going to ask the honorable mention students to come and we'll put their necklaces on, and then the exam. Perfect. Thank Perfect. you. Thank you. Thank you. We've got some virtual students, too. Scott. There you go. Judy. So the other students competed virtually. And so they are included. All right, where's the passport? You get to draw two names. All right, so before uh, we close, we're going to draw the winners of the STEM passport drawing. Judy's drawing that now. So thanks for our exhibitors for being with us again this year. The two winners are Trinity Dalton. Victor, but that's his project number. We have Victor uh, Physics, project number 008. You don't have a last name. Okay. All right. And these are two $25 cash gifts. Okay. All right. Yes. Go get your picture made. All right, so we're going to call up all of the honorable mention award winners all at one time so that you can get your medals. So if you received an honorable mention, please come to the stage. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Congrats again. Thank you. Congrats again. Congrats again. Congrats. Congrats again. All right. Now we're going to call up all the exemplary award winners at one time to receive your plaques. All right, thank you all so much for allowing us to spend the day with you. Um, students, good luck in all of your future endeavors. And at this time, I would like to ask our co-director, Dr. Tom Williams, to come forward with some closing remarks. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Sanders. Raise your hand if you were here when Ishan Brar made some comments this morning at opening session. Raise your hand. Remember one of the things he said? Don't worry about failing. 
right? Science and engineering is all about finding out processes that we can improve. So thank you for your patience with us today. I do hope as the day comes to a close for you, your students have had a great experience with our interacting with our judges here on the NC State campus. We are delighted and honored to have them here to represent students from all across North Carolina. We hope as the year progresses, you'll continue to follow us on social media, that you'll continue to support your students and to support your teachers as they move forward with research in the coming year. We want to thank you and congratulate you again. Have a safe journey home today. Uh, don't forget to take your projects out of um, Carmichael Gymnasium if you've not already picked them up by 5 o'clock, okay? Everybody good? Have a great day. Thank you.